I'm William Sawbridge from JJ Sawbridge and Sons Limited, um, farm at Lodge Farm, Castlethorpe. Predominantly a cereal farmer. We're covering over sort of 3,750 acres at the moment. Conservation is, is in my agenda. Um, we have quite a substantial mid-tier scheme um, in place, but predominantly we large on growing cereals. Um, I did own a class selection 770, um, which I was very pleased with. And when I actually sort of had a telephone call from one of my neighbours and sort of asked me if I'd be interested in, in doing his work for him, um, I took that with uh, open arms and I realised that I'd actually got to up my, up my combine capacity. So um, I went to class to ask them for another combine. They couldn't actually help me out. So I spoke to, uh, to Matthew, Matthew Velicott and Dan Phipps and these two combines uh, became available. Um, the one behind me uh, was at Newark. Um, I went down there and I saw it and I thought, yeah, that'll, that'll tick the box. And then I went to Milton Common to, to, uh, to look at the, uh, the 690. Um, very easy to deal with. Um, productivity, because we large on uh, quality wheat. Um, we grow either seed wheat here or milling wheat. There is no feed wheat at all unless we fail our premium, which touch wood, I haven't done that for quite some time. Um, the premium to me is worth a lot of money um, and getting it in the shed, bringing it into the yard here, uh, it makes it safe. So my premium there is secure. Um, productivity and as they are, the guys love driving them. Uh, nothing better than having, having your telephone and working out where they are and what they're doing. Um, finding out what yield mapping, yield mapping is instant. You know if there's a problem in a field um, for what, whatever reason you sit back and you work it out what the problem is. And to me, that's worth a lot of money. And to actually see where your trailers are on the road, um, that is also important to me. The one thing that I have found and a saving is knowing, having that uh, information to your hand where you know where your trailers are. Actually, I'm actually now going to get rid of two trailers. I had six for these, for these guys, but it was, that was too much. So I'm going to go to four trailers um, and it then frees up a tractor that would be used for corn cart, which is now going to go into the field. Um, so to me, it's a tick, tick, tick. Everything is covered. Um, as regards header on these combines, that's one thing that we did talk about. We have the, um, I call it the old power flow table. Um, the guys love them for, for combining barley. It just feeds it in, the combine just takes it. Uh, obviously there's a minor adjustment, but it doesn't take hours, it's like a minute. Um, going on towards seed rate, put your side knives on, it's not a problem. Everything is easily done. And if, you, if it's easily done, you guys in the field are happy. Uh, one of the other things I like is um, you get the same guy each time, so he knows the machine. So if you buy a sprayer, it's probably going to be Jerry or Paul, and they've looked after our sprayers. If it's going to be a, an, uh, an 8370 tractor, it's going to be Ian. Um, on the combines, it's going to be Ian. And it's having that relationship with those guys. That's to me, that, that's because they know who you are. And I must say, I mean, Matt, I'm going to say this, he's got some bloody good folks working in, in amongst Farrell. You walk in there and there'll be a face you relate to. You know they'll pick the phone up. It's like Charlie. I mean, I think the world of Charlie. But there are times when he's so busy. And I know that. But he's a good boy. And if he sees my number, he'll phone me back. Which is... That's how it should be. And you know the job will be done. It's as simple as that. It is as simple as that.